<clears throat> Hi, Mrs. Morton. This is Marty over at the Fan Supply Co. I just giving you a quick call back. Hi, Marty. How's it going? It's going well, thank you. Um, I just wanted to follow up. I was able to speak with Carl, our office manager, um, just upon that issue, um, the brackets that you mentioned. But I just wanted to see, was that the only thing that was missing or was there something else that concerned you? Um, let me take a quick look and just see if there are any other missing parts. Okay. Um, yeah, just give me a second to look. Yeah, no problem. I appreciate you doing that. Let's check under here. No, I, I think those are the only ones that are missing. Okay. Okay, well, let's kind of get you squared away. I know that this was pretty abrupt for you. I know you're expecting the, uh, the installation crew today. Um, I, I can't apologize more to you about that. Um, I'm actually really grateful that you were able to reach out um, and that you really, you wanted to have the relationship. You wanted to get the value from our company. Um, as we're kind of moving forward though, Mrs. Morton, um, I just want to make sure that as, as a customer, you feel like you're being treated fairly um, and that we can offer you um, the best service that you can. You, you feel like you're um, getting a good deal with this as well. But what does that look like to you? What do you feel would be fair to resolve this? Well, I think in lieu of the situation with the installation happening sometime today, um, if, I mean, I guess it depends if you guys can get us those pieces today. If not, we're gonna have to cancel and probably wait a little bit longer. If we end up waiting a little bit longer, um, I would kind of expect um, maybe some type of discount or or money back or or something else to kind of compensate for that um, because it is kind of a, a, a unique situation, I guess. I don't know. It's yeah. a little bit heartbreaking not to get things done when you need them. Um, so, I mean, as I mean, it de I guess it depends if you guys can get us those pieces today or not. Okay. Um, so what are your thoughts on that? Yeah, uh, you mentioned kind of today, you mentioned a time frame um, and about the installation as well. I have kind of two thoughts. Um, the first one being, if we can get it done today um, and like I can get those brackets done, unfortunately I'm not able to be there myself right now. I have um, a, just another quick call to make. Um, so I won't be able to be there myself today. Um, but if I was able to do that tomorrow morning, make that a priority, if I had just covered the cost of the brackets, um, and instead of it being full price for the installation, uh, would you be okay if we just discounted you that the fifty percent of the installation? Do you think that's fair, or is there another kind of idea that you have? Um, yeah, I mean, I think that would be fine. Um, I guess it just depends if the they can also make it out in the morning or, or whatever their schedule is. I know that they're they're really booked these days. Um, another quick question for you is, sure. do you know if um, we would be coming to you to pick up those brackets or you guys would be coming to us to pick them up? I mean, uh, drop them off. You're good. Yeah, that's a good question. We'd actually, we'd just send them with the installation crew. So if they just come uh, drive over to your shop and install, install that for you. Gotcha. Um, so you don't have to worry about coming to us. We just take care of that. Okay. Um, yeah, I think that would be fine if, the, if that's how things work out. Um, like, would you be contacting them or would I be contacting them about it? No, I can cover that. Um, and what I'll actually do, just kind of as a, a point of reference, um, I, would you prefer me to, to call you in the morning or would you prefer just an email of the exact time that they'll be there? Um, maybe both. I think sometimes communication get, can <laughs> get a little tricky. So, <laughs> right. I mean, if yeah. you could email me maybe tonight and then call in the morning just to double check and make sure everything's good to go, that'd be good. Okay, perfect. Um, yeah, I think uh, I'll just kind of recap uh, what we mentioned. So, um, we'll actually, we'll cover the 50% the of the install just out of appreciation for you being patient um, mm -hmm. again. And uh, we'll, we'll just kind of cover the cost of the brackets. There's no problem at all. Um, and that way we don't have to do any other discounts or charges, but, um, and then I'll send an email and give you a phone call in the morning. Um, but when's the best time to call? Um, my kids are normally up around 7.38. Okay. Um, so don't call before then. <laughs> Absolutely. Please call yeah. like 
after eight would probably be preferable. Okay. Um, after this call, I'm actually just going to get on with uh, the install crew. But if I called you around nine o'clock just to confirm plans, is that okay? Yeah, that would be great. Okay, so that's nine a.m. Perfect. Thank you so much, Mrs. Morton. Um, yeah, I think just as we're moving forward, it's just important to think about that you're my greatest priority. Um, I, I'm sorry that this happened. These things do happen, though, whether it was on your end or our end. Um, but I guess just as we're moving forward, uh, I just invite you to keep looking at the, the fan supply co. Um, and if there's any other things that we can do for you, we'd be happy to, to make that work. Sound fair? Yeah, that sounds great. Thank you so much for all your help. Absolutely. I know it's kind of a <laughs> tricky situation to be in, so I appreciate you being willing to work with me and figure things out as we go. Sounds good, Mrs. Morton. Again, have a good day and uh, enjoy your time with your family. I'll let you go. Thank you so much. Have a good day, Marty. You as well. Bye.